as you walk on the aircraft this is a view you get as you can see you have your blanket your headphones and a pillow there's a close-up view of it your entertainment system and you can see i had a person next to me which luckily was my sister it was the b triple seven three hundred and they give you a complimentary water obviously you can order as many waters and drinks as you want there is a place on the floor for your shoes as well as you have two windows you have the controls on the side you can use you have controls over there as you can see to charge any electronics and you can control the visor going up and down that was set in a 7-7 configuration so it went 2-3-2 two, 2-3-2 three, two, two, three, two. we had kids next to us and they were actually really well behaved there you can see the divider going up and you can bring it down so it really makes you feel like you in your own little little bubble the entertainment system is really good in the touchscreen you can see it is really reactive it I didn't have a problem with it at all so if you're sitting forward you can use that touchscreen if you want or you can use the little touchscreen computer which is on your side which is also you can see it has all of the information it's very reactive you can choose any option you want through there you can choose your movies you can watch your tv shows your radio and you can be watching live uh, live sport on there while you have a movie playing on the other screen so i think that is very very helpful you can see there also you can adjust your seat your light and you can save positions on the seat you like as well as searching and then that function there is to control the main tv screen without having to lean forward and grab it you get complimentary champagne or orange juice it's not dom perignon what you get in first class but it's still really good quality and it also still tastes pretty damn nice you can see me and my sisters just cheersing our drink there Here's me opening up the headphones you get on the Emirates Business Class. Not all the new First Class have upgraded to the E1s. So this is exactly the same headphones you'll get on most First Class flights. It's exactly the same, the old Bose type setup with the noise cancelling which you just swap up on the side. But they're very comfortable and you normally can find yourself sleeping on them and they don't hurt your ears or side of your head too much there's your menu it is in arabic and in english you got your cocktails your mocktails your soft drinks hot teas and all your cocktails you can think of you can even ask them to make you things off this menu and if they know it they won't hesitate to help you there's your dinner ah you'll see later the salmon and prawn terrine and I had the stir fried beef with ginger and garlic. You have your light bites, which you can order throughout the flight as long as it's available, as many times as you want. You'll see I did not because I was really full. You you got more enough leg room than you know what to do with. If you're sitting normally, your legs won't come close to touching the front board. And then this is just a little time lapse of us taking off as we're leaving the Ghana airport. The blanket you find is a pretty standard blanket you'll find on most business classes. It's really thick. The one side is nice and soft. The other side, which obviously goes along your body, and the other side is more rough and gives it a nice rigid look. you got the Emirates badge, and it's really big, so you can literally roll yourself in it and have a nice, comfortable flight. Here's your tray table, what folds out. You can see it's really big and it has an option to slide forward so if you want more room because if you feel like your stomach is getting full from eating you just put it on there push it forward and then you can just close it up and slide it back down and it doesn't obstruct your view of the TV or your side thing at all you can actually take this little iPad thing off what they call it well they don't call it I call it that you can go through your movies you can control everything from the main TV through that which is also really really helpful and it's just a nice touch because you don't have to be leaning forward the whole time especially if your bed's all the way back you just unclip it you can click play and it its reaction time is really really good the only thing was the first time i tried to put the uh, the plans up or down it was still locked you can see from takeoff even though we were 
about 10 minutes from from leaving the ground so i just let them know and they said they apologized they quickly unlocked it and then straight away it has a normal once down and then two down really to blind out all the light even though it was night and it's not really needed i put it down anyways you can see the second one coming down now and it just blocks it out completely I uh, got an old fashioned on the plane and they always give it an option with some nuts and the nuts are really really good quality really nice and toasted and they come warm you can see my sister didn't didn't get the nuts because she didn't want it but here is my salmon terrine I think it was called it's probably the nicest starter I've ever had on the plane it was really really good also to just say this is not down on demand as you get in first class they have times but they don't have any trays he has my sister's food trays they take your order and they come and bring it to you so you don't have any tray uh, like uh, trays going up and down the middle of the aisles he has my main which was a stir fried beef i took the olives out of my salad because i didn't want to eat the olives and the cutlery is really really good quality this was some of the nicest cheese i've had on a plane they gave me three options of cheese two crackers an apricot and a grape and they served it on this slate this this uh, slate black slate and it was really nice is because it was actually ice cold so it just gave it a really nice vibe a really nice feel when i touched it and it was just a nice touch there you can see i'm adjusting the air that's blowing above me and i'm not doing the seat all the way down i'm just doing it midway so it can remember my position putting it getting comfortable because i don't allow all the way back and getting ready to watch a movie so that's not all the way, that's just reasonably comfortable. As you can see they have lighting all the way down the side of the aeroplane. It does change color and it does dim when it comes to sleep time. You have the overhead storage compartments. As in first class you don't have any of that. You have them all by your feet. There's a light switch up there especially when you're recording. So that's a really really nice touch. Also not recording when you're reading sorry. They have another light above which is a single tap or a double tap which just changes the brightness and then it turns it off. Now this is me just showing how you can control the main TV by using the TV next to you. You can turn up the volume, you can change the brightness and you can even change the contrast. And the very nice thing about this, what I only found out after flying hundreds of times, I only found out you can actually turn off the main TV because I didn't realize this, the white little light at the bottom, you touch it to bring up this and you can turn the main tv off and your mode controller and it makes it really nice and dark and you can sleep the one thing i must say you do get a little bit of light bouncing off from the tv screen next to you and in the cabin so i would recommend then you do put your headphones on your eye shadows and your headphones on and you don't hear anything this is the toiletry bag they give you it's exactly the same design as the first class bag but i believe the first class bag is changing but instead of it being leather it is more of a cloth type material but it's also by Bulgari and it has all the same things and except you don't get the spray deodorant you get the roll-on which is a slight difference but the shape and everything is the same but i want to thank you guys so much for watching please like this video if you found it informative and thanks again